वेलकम बैक आई एम प्रताप हियर टुडे इज द ट्वेंटी सेवंथ मार्च ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर इन दिस वीडियो लेट एस जनरेट बुलिश एंड बेरिश ट्रेड सेटअप्स फॉर मंथली इनकम ट्रेड एंड वीकली इनकम ट्रेड इवन बिफोर दैट ए स्मॉल अनाउंसमेंट प्लीज इफ दिस इज यवर फर्स्ट विजिट इफ दिस इज यवर फर्स्ट विजिट टू अवर चैनल प्लीज अंडरस्टैंड वी आर प्रोवाइडिंग कंप्लीट फ्री ट्रेनिंग ऑन सप्लाई डिमांड जोन प्राइज एक्शन कोर्स all the training videos are available at our youtube channel even i have kept all these videos in a playlist supply demand zone price action course at our neo stock youtube channel even i have also provided the link to this playlist in this youtube video description if you click the link you will get into this space and then scroll down to the bo bottom of this space here starting from lesson 1.1 all the training videos are available in an order please go through all these videos one by one and strengthen your skills related to supply demand zone price action even i have provided the link to our telegram channel in this youtube video description please join in the channel it will be helpful to you each time when we release a new youtube video we will provide an update in the channel now let's get into the report generation with the help of neo stock software supply demand zone top down analysis strategy builder now we are generating a bullish trade setup for monthly income trade in monthly income trade htf time frame is monthly itf time frame is weekly and ltf time frame or entry time frame is daily so that is the reason why i am selecting entry time frame as daily because we are generating bullish trade setup selecting entry zone as a demand zone in bullish or bearish trade setup parameter for daily time frame i am selecting the value bullish i will also set three uh, filters the first filter is uh, we don't want the pierced zones so the pierced count should be zero and look into the last parameter in this space in daily time frame i am setting the minimum value zero and maximum value zero which indicates uh, the peers to count should be zero peers to count indicate zero means it is not a peers zone and the second parameter i am setting zone achievement as voz violated opposing zone and for bullish or bearish trade setup a minimum odd enhancer score should be 12 so i am setting the value 12 now i am filtering the stocks so these 16 stocks are filtered currently they are supporting bullish trade setup for monthly income trade so you can uh, go through all these parameters or even if you require uh, take these uh, leg in base and leg out leg in we have a date leg in date number of base candles and a leg out date based on these values you can draw the zones on your charts so i'm giving you only few seconds time to watch this page and then i move on to the next page so i request you pause the video study all these parameters if required you draw the zones on the charts and analyze after that you can further proceed with this video so i'm going back now i am going to generate bearish trade setup for monthly income trade so entry time frame is daily but entry zone should be supply zone because it is bearish trade setup and in bullish or bearish trade setup in daily time frame i am selecting bearish remaining parameters already we set in previously pierced count is zero zone achievement is voz and a minimum odd enhancer score should be 12 now let me generate the stocks so only currently only one stock is filtered which is supporting bearish trade setup now i am going to generate a bullish and bearish trade setups for a weekly income trade for weekly income trade our entry time frame should be 75 minutes in weekly income trade htf is a weekly time frame itf is a daily time frame ltf that is entry time frame is 75 minutes 
and a bullish trade setup uh, entry time entry zone should be demand zone in bullish or bearish trade setup this time we are selecting 75 minutes time frame there we are setting the value bullish and three filters we need to add first filter is uh, we don't want peers or zones so that's why we are setting peers to count for 75 minutes time frame we are setting minimum value 0 and maximum value 0 and the zone achievement we are selecting VOZ violated opposing zone and a minimum order enhancer score 12 we are giving now let's filter so 14 stocks are filtered so currently these 14 stocks are supporting bullish trade setup for weekly income trade so I am moving back now let us generate bearish trade setup for uh, weekly income trade so entry time frame is 75 minutes but entry zone should be supply zone because it is bearish trade setup and in bullish or bearish trade setup 75 minutes time frame I am selecting bearish and remaining parameters what we set in the previous screen they are applicable zone achievement minimum order enhancer score as well as the peers count now let us filter the stocks so currently these four stocks are supporting bearish trade setup for a weekly income trade so we have completed both bullish and bearish trade setups for weekly income trade as well as a monthly income trade now we will generate the final report that is a stop buffers We are generating stop buffers based on ATR, daily ATR, daily ATR. So here we have a daily ATR column and also we generated 15% ATR, 10%. The 15% ATR is for monthly income trade, 10% ATR is for weekly income trade. So you can make use of these values for calculating, for defining your st uh, stop buffers. I mean... Uh, calculating your stop loss based on these stop buffers and the first 17 in this list are indices remaining all are equity stocks but they are listed in FNO segment so what I do I keep on scrolling this list down by giving you few seconds time if you want to refer any of these stocks parameters pause the video so once you note down these values then you can further proceed with the video so I am scrolling down So this is the final list. Hope this information will be useful to you for your further study and analysis. Let us all meet again in our next video. Thank you.